Lumira integrates with Microsoft 365 and collects unified audit logs for threat detection. This is available for commercial and GCC high environments. Before you begin, confirm your Microsoft licensing includes Audit Standard or Audit Premium. This is included in most Microsoft license packages. As a tip, you can verify licensing and subscriptions from the Microsoft Admin Center and then refer to this feature matrix to see if the audit is included. Audit Premium provides the most event data with higher bandwidth access to the data. You'll also need to be a Microsoft Admin with global administrator permissions. Now you're ready to get started with your integration. First, verify that auditing is enabled. After enabling auditing, it can take 60 minutes for the change to take effect and then up to 72 hours before logs can be retrieved. Your Bloomera Cloud Connector may continue to fail and show an error while Microsoft processes the change. Make sure that audit logging is enabled before you proceed with configuring the Cloud Connector. Next, create the application in Microsoft. This process involves creating the application and then providing Bloomera with the application or client ID and the directory or tenant ID. After that, you'll enable permissions and create the credentials in Microsoft for Bloomera to ingest the logs. First, select Office 365 Management API. You're gonna grant the delegated permissions for activityfeed.read, activityfeed.read DLP, and servicehealth.read, as well as the same permissions under the application permissions heading. Next, select Microsoft Graph and then check the options for application permissions, user read all. Now, grant admin consent for the Bloomera application and create the secret key for Bloomera to authenticate to your Microsoft environment. As a tip, when creating the secret, take note of when the secret ID expires to ensure that it can be updated and that there is no disruption of this service. Finally, provide the secret to Bloomera. Ensure that you copy the value of the secret into the account to avoid errors. And please note, sometimes it takes a moment on the Microsoft side to propagate the permissions and secret. So if it gives an error in Bloomera, just wait a short while and try again. That's it. Your new integration is all set up. Thanks for watching.